session of the 75th Congress closes with four of the President's chief bills unpassed, and a special session threatens. For Justice Hugo Black, shown with family, whose nomination to the Supreme Court raised a Senate storm, it is the last session. A woman succeeds Black in the Senate, Dixie Bibb Grave Center, appointed by her own husband, Alabama's governor. Patty Carraway is the only other woman in the upper house. The last congressional word having been written into the records, they are filed away in the archives, and the work of the lawmakers becomes permanent legislative history. Senator Key Pittman gets ready to return to his Nevada mountains and trout streams. <laughs> he does a neat job of filing his papers of state. Representative Mountain of Louisiana gets the last free shave. Well, Gene, old man, this is positively the last free shave of the 75th Congress. Me for Lafayette, Louisiana tomorrow. The legislators are vacation bound, back home to tell the voters all about it. Transportation's free and they aren't wasting any time. But soon they'll be shuffling off to Buffalo and Oskaloosa and Keokuk, free of the cares of state. And despite the likelihood of a special session soon, they're like a lot of kids out of school. 